Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing a tutorial on this look here. It's a nice cool tone brown with a little pop of colour on the eyelids. Hopefully you'll enjoy it. So if you want to see how I made this face, then keep watching. So I've already gone and done my foundation with my Urban Decay All Nighter as I normally do. And now I'm going to go into some contouring with my NYX contour palette. I'm going to use the shade Sculpt, which is this one. Um, it works with my skin tone, it's like a nice cool tone contour shade. And I'm going to be using my Morphe M143, big nice fan brush. go a little bit on the jawline just to sharpen it up a little bit on my forehead as well I'm going to get a smaller brush I'm going to use the M330 and get that same sculpt colour again and just lightly contour down my nose give it a little bit more of a straight shape and for my highlight actually now I'm going to do my blusher first I'm going to use my Elizabeth Arden blusher this darker one called sun blush which is nice I'm going to use the M462 just swirl that over the apples of my cheeks and for a highlighter I'm going to use the highlight from the same palette and I'm going to use Fan brush 310 and pick up quite a lot with it. Get a good coat. And put a bit on the end of my nose down the middle basically everywhere I'm going to do my eyebrows with the NYX micro brow pencil mine's in the shade Auburn which is pretty it's quite orange um, my hair's ginger still at the minute, so it's doing the job for me. So that's my brows done. I'm going to get that highlight shade again on a 124, which is just a little bit smaller and flatter. And I'm just going to intensify that brow bone a bit more. And then, of course, I'm going to do my eyeshadow. I'm going for a brownie, mustardy yellow look today. I'm going to start with my... Elizabeth Arden palette and I'm going to use this middle brown shade here it's called Urban Roots 
and I'm going to use that in the crease as a bit of a transition shade and really really blend it out because it is dark. I'm going to use this NYX shade, Coquette, and just soften up the edges. I'm going to use that brush that I used for my nose contour, just because it's a bit thinner. And I'm going to go back into that darker brown just on the very end of the brush and darken that crease to give it a bit more depth another NYX one guilt trip another brown same brush Starting in my inner corner. And a bit of that Elizabeth Arden brown as well. And the NYX Guilt Trip under the outer corners of my lower eyelid. Which I think looks pretty nice and then I'm going to get that flat M124 again and spray it with just a bit of setting spray just to dampen it a bit mine's just the NYX dewy finish spray I've got it on my leg now and I'm going to take STFU from NYX which is like a bright yellow it's not quite mustard but it's not like neon yellow it's got a bit of darkness to it I'm going to pick up some of that and press it into the center of my eye And then I'm going to take a little pencil brush, the, where is it, M222, and I'm going to take, I'm going to make a little bit of a mix of this orangey shade, lol, and guilt trip again, just so it's not a bright, bright orange. And I'm going to blend out that yellow into the, the brownie shades. And I'm gonna take that orangey shade with a bit of the yellow shade mixed in for the inner part of my under eye 
very lightly. I don't want it to be too crazy. And a bit of that highlight shade that we used earlier on my finger just pressed in to my inner corners. So for my eyeliner I'm just going to use my NYX black liquid liner. Give it a bit of a shake. I'm finally not using the pen anymore because it's just too empty. It's it needs replacing by now, I've had it for too long. I'm not going to do any more on that because it'll just get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. First I'm going to curl my eyelashes which I forgot to do. So. Mascara. I'm really sorry guys, my um, camera ran out, of batch, ran out of memory and normally it makes a little ping when it does that so I know to like delete some stuff and like continue recording. It didn't ping and I looked up after doing my mascara and my lipstick and it was like it hadn't recorded any of it so that's really annoying but for my mascara I used the new Rimmel Volume Shake. Um, which I really like the the lift that it gives my eyelashes and for my lips I used a Revlon lipstick in Coffee Bean see that? yeah Coffee Bean with just a bit more of that um, NYX brown eyeshadow over the top to make it a little bit more matte so yeah this is the finished look guys and I really really hope that you've enjoyed this video and that you like the look that I've created uh, I hope you can like this video, subscribe to my channel, uh, leave some comments down below on what you thought and uh, oh yeah and share, share it to your friends, tell them I'm here and I really really hope to see you on the next video so thanks a lot guys, bye see you later